Hello friends, my name is Durga and uh, as part of Windows for IT Professionals, I am currently working on uh, 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 how to set up VM so that you can explore uh, technologies um, on your Windows laptop. And uh, so far uh, we have uh, set up Sigwin uh, earlier and then uh, we are in the process of setting up our v virtual uh, 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 VM environment on our laptop. As part of that process we have created, we have installed VMware workstation and we have created a uh, VM uh, but we have not installed any OS on that. So in this video we will see how to install OS. And I hope, uh, as mentioned in my previous video, you already uh, downloaded uh, CentOS 6.6 uh, ISO image, and we will see how to uh, use that and set up the uh, set up our VM. Okay, so already uh, set up OS on our VM. Already we have the VM, so click on that, and we have to mount our uh, uh, CD drive. So you have to click on Edit Virtual Machine Settings and then you will see this window you you have to choose cd or dvd and then uh, if you have dvd you can just plug in and you can choose it but in our case we are using iso image so click on use iso image and click on browse so uh, go to the location where you have copied your iso image in my case it's under uh, users see users this one underscore zero 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 and in this i have created uh, a directory called softwares and there i have sent this image and uh, typically we'll see two uh, two images like this uh, two isos two isos like this dvd1 and dvd2 you just have to choose the first one from here and click on ok okay now uh, your vm will uh, uh, now you have the cd or dvd or iso image mounted onto your vm now you can power on this virtual machine okay click on okay and i want to do the uh, minimal installation using uh, uh, text so for that i have to edit the options and it is asking to press tab to edit options and uh, if you hit tab like this it will not work because the control is not in the vm to give the uh, cursor to the vm uh, make sure your mouse cursor is on the uh, on this blue screen don't go out and click make sure you are on the blue screen click on it now the control is on the v uh, is with the vm and hit tab otherwise it will not work so make sure the hand symbol of mouse cursor on this blue screen and uh, click on it and now the control is, uh, is on uh, then the control will be with the vm and you have to hit tab to see the uh, to see this option in that hit the space and then type text expert okay and then hit enter now the uh, os the installation of os is started on our vm It will not take very long time, so I am not pausing it as of now. Okay, and uh, uh, typically uh, in production environments, you have to uh, test your media. Media is nothing but ISOs in this case. But in, in this case, I am sure that my, uh, my ISOs are fine, so I am directly going to skip. If you click on OK to test the media, it will take time because you have almost 4 GB uh, ISO images, uh, ISO image. So I am just skipping, hit enter. Hit OK. Yeah, I am using English, so OK. It's US English, so OK. And uh, ignore, reinitialize all. And I want to use central time zone. Means whatever time zone you want to use, you can go for it. Okay, you 
you have to give the password make it simple password because it's your pc and nothing you will not have anything uh, important to production hit okay use anyway and uh, you just hit okay right changes to disk so now we started install it uh, installing the centos on your uh, uh, on your virtual machine why i am doing uh, expert installation is that uh, if you if you try to install uh, uh, defaults it will typically install the desktop and uh, to set up your uh, uh, other softwares um, to explore uh, any technology in big data space like cassandra hadoop and all those things you typically don't will not install on desktop okay and also if you think about it uh, even if you are interacting with linux uh, systems on your as part of your work you will use putty or sigwin or uh, some ssh tool to connect to the system uh, and then you will uh, work on that you, you will never go to the linux using desktop so to to give that to uh production feel or uh, your work feel uh, i am trying to install using text expert and the other reason is the performance so when you have uh, a 16 gb or 8 gb laptop uh, for you uh, for your uh, uh, personal purpose uh, when you start setting up uh, a virtual machines on your uh, uh, system you might have to play with three four virtual machines at the same time and if you install uh, uh, desktop on each of them then most of the resources will be wasted to support the desktop which you will never use so i will highly recommend to avoid uh, setting up uh, uh, using desktop just install minimal using text expert and it uh, and it will install only 228 uh, 220 packages and uh, then whatever package you want you can just install very easily which which i will show you in the later videos so the installation is all, almost done and uh, let's wait for a moment and uh, uh, we will wrap up so that's it uh, the installation of centos on your pc uh, on your vm is done so now you have a vm with uh, centos 6.6 Uh, and uh, uh, in the next video we will uh, uh, see the prerequisites uh, and you can hit reboot so that your system is rebooted so as part of the prerequisites i will talk about uh, uh, all the common prerequisites like uh, uh, disabling sc linux uh, uh, play uh, uh, turning off your uh, firewalls and all those things which are required for most of the uh, uh, enterprise uh, uh, technologies to be uh, set up on your uh, vm and as as pa, uh, as, uh, as we are using a uh, creating a base template as they are applicable to all in the next video we will see all those prerequisites which are typically applicable to almost all the uh, 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 vms for our future purposes so until then uh, bye yeah one more thing i want to tell you when you when your mouse is uh, uh, under vm's control to come out of it you have to hit control alt okay otherwise you you will not be able to come out of it hit control alt to come out of it and then uh, you can uh, you can access your pc otherwise yeah, you cannot access your pc using mouse uh, Uh, if the if the cursor is under vm's control that issue will be resolved down the line uh, but for now uh, you have to hit that